Hello, West Shore. We're glad to join in the celebration of your 75th anniversary. We were asked to offer some reflections on, and here I quote, fulfilling accomplishments that move the congregation forward. What were the major milestones and perhaps challenges of the time you served? What were some more personal goals that you achieved? Well, we did some of that in the last sermon we, we shared with you five years ago, but when we look back at that sermon, there was one thing that the five years of watching you from a distance have made more clear than ever. There are no individual accomplishments or personal goals that can be achieved in the life of a congregation. Nothing moves forward without the support of many leaders and many supporters. Ministerial leadership means nothing if it doesn't reveal or respond to what the congregation wants and where it wants to go next. So while we remember with pride and with love all that happened at West Shore during our 16 years with you, they are memories of what we did together. We loved the worship and music life we shared with you and the approach to working collaboratively on worship through the Worship Associates program that brought dozens of you into the pulpit regularly. We love being part of the evolution of the small and doing racism reading group into a diversity ministry and then into a congregation-wide commitment to racial justice and now decentering whiteness. We loved enjoying the vibrant and loyal LGBTQ community we found at West Shore and remember well the first pride parade we joined with only a few of you that slowly over time became 50 or more every year. We loved the transformation of the building. So do we dare to leap in the future? If so, what's the answer? Yes! yes. One, two, three! Yes. Oh. Now in recent years through the labor of so many leaders in capital campaigns and in the Buildings and Grounds Committee and on the construction projects. We are also proud that the Memorial Garden came to fruition. We love the times when people would come together with us to take on difficult and risky issues where no other area churches seem to be taking a stand, like ending human trafficking, displaying a rainbow flag or a Black Lives Matter banner, or defending and partnering with our friends in the Muslim and Latinx communities when they were threatened or disregarded. We love being connected to your families, dedicating your children, seeing them grow through the religious education programs and youth groups that you made possible through your volunteer service. We loved exploring what it meant to practice a UU religious life through your responsiveness to what we could teach and offer through adult religious education and spiritual discipline. Nothing that involved our leadership happened without the dedicated and delightful staff that we had the joy of working with as part of a long-term team for so many years. And so we have to offer a shout out in this video to Debbie and Suhanna and Kathy Strausser still serving you in the pastoral care role. And talking about all these things we remember well and loved about our time at West Shore, we are tempted to shout out more names of the people who made them possible, but that would make this video twice as long. And you know who you are. So thank you for all you gave us over 16 years of ministry with you. Celebrate well. You are, you are missed, missed and, and you, you are loved. loved.